This is actually an NES RPG by Capcom. For anyone that has uh, ever seen or read Romance of the Three Kingdom, this is loosely based on that. Yeah, let's uh, fix that. <laughs> You don't have to level up every single officers individually. Strat? Well, yeah, you do have strats. You have strategy. Those are essentially your quote-unquote magic spells. We start with none, unfortunately. Yubi is pretty decent, mainly there to get you started, essentially. Your soldiers are your HP, essentially. Strength is self-explanatory. Intelligence determines how much the officer will be affected by strategies and can inflict them. And if they have an high enough intelligence, they can actually qualify to be as strategists themselves. There is an hidden stats as well. There is the agility stats, which unfortunately is not shown anywhere. AP is uh, your attack power. That's determined by whatever weapon you have equipped. AC, essentially your defense. TP, TP for my PP. Tactical points that the officer can use if there's can uh, provide to the army if there's a strategist. Wanyu is pretty powerful. He is one of seven officers as well that will increase their soldier count through level ups. Zhengfei is pure strength. Make sure you equip your shit before you get out. As long as you don't gag stupidly, you should never have to buy food. Food is only consumed on the world map, if I remember correctly. And more importantly, we've got the horse. Song Yong is fucking terrible. He's not powerful. He's stupid. Don't use him. As soon as you can bench him, fucking do it. He's fucking useless. Still not good. But at least he can actually use strategy. Guess what? We're already changing strategists because he's better in every way. Like, in every way. He's better than both the Song Brothers. The houses with this type of door are your hints, usually. Goodbye, Song Young. <laughs> Go and be benched. <laughs> Sometimes you want to check to some places because there are some hidden items at some places. Clearly, we need to check in this bed. Nope. <laughs> Our first battle is actually a kind of a boss battle. This is a uh, warlord battle. Essentially, it's a defender of a location. Right now, we have no strategy, but we do want to check on the opponents. Like Zhang Bao. He has access to a bunch of tactics. We don't want him to use any of them. So we'll probably be targeting him first. As for Cheng Yuanzi, he is pretty dumb. Let's, uh, let's not even worry too much about him. And then we have generic rebel forces, which honestly, don't worry about it. Okay, he failed in this tactic. For now, yeah, we just want to concentrate our efforts on Zhang Bao. Yeah, that's bad. There we go. And thankfully, this is not like Final Fantasy 1. There is auto-targeting, so if the opponent you are targeting at first dies, you actually target the other one afterwards. And now that the main threat is gone, Capcom actually brought a very nice thing in this game called the all-out attack. Essentially, you go on the all-out offensive until you press B. You continue to do that until either your side or their side goes down. Let's check it out. So yeah, whenever you know you're gonna win, the all-out attack is your best tactic. We just got enough uh, experience for a level up. Bian Huo is its our uh, first fire tactic. Usually when you get a random battle against random bandage, just go all out, you're gonna win. Uh, thank you, Mike, for the sub on YouTube. <laughs> 
Why did that come up now? This is based on a manga slash anime. So let's go ahead with the uh, Guan Yu and Mi Zhe. I actually use our tactic here. Unfortunately, that can't fail. There we go, 80 soldiers down. Just like that. Retreat, they're too strong. And it's time for another level up. 130. 130. Shangren, Mize, learn Wujian. Which is a water tactic, hyper situational. I never find a good occasion to actually use this. If you talk to certain NPCs in towns, you can get attacked. This is certainly one of these occasions. Oh, we can use that? Let's try it. I don't think it'll work. Let's try it anyways. We're gonna use Lianiho. I'm just gonna be yelling afterwards anyways. Oh no, it's protection against fire. Okay. No big deal then. Let's just go all out. He doesn't even get a death quote. And this guy actually dies. We never see him again. No, no level up! Sweet! 148, 149. Well, uh, Zhang Fei actually gets a bigger growth eventually. Sweet too. All right, no, he doesn't die, he just stick here for some reason. He's somewhat decent, he's mostly a tactician, but he's better than Song Ren, so I'm just gonna be benching him. Also, this can happen. Commander battles. Sometimes random battles will actually have uh, officers in them. If you defeat them, you can actually have a chance to recruit them, so... It can be a good idea. Zhang Mao is actually a mistranslation. It's supposed to be Dang Mao. AKA the guy that gets killed by Guan Yu in the story. Already you made there must be a river nearby. Okay, so Shui Tu is actually the, uh, the water tactic. Anyways, let's lose Lian Huo. I'm gonna be going back in town anyway, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> Fucking song ran. Let's find out if we get a recruit and random recruitment here. We do not. How do I know this? Because uh, there would be a blinking arrow that points down if we did. And there was not. <laughs> yeah, it, it has that old uh, NES mentality, though. One step encounter. No Tan Zhong here. He's not good, but take note of him. I'm just saying. He will use his freaking tactics. So it might be a good idea to have Mize actually use a tactic to protect against fire. Yeah, 40 damage. Might not seem like much, but it's still quite a bit. Okay, use the tactic. I don't even know what it does. It might increase their defense. It's usually very negligible, honestly. We definitely want to defeat Zhang Jiao as quickly as we can. Whenever your soldier count goes down, so does your attack power. Retreat, they're too strong. Shigzin, which is actually a very good tactic. Why? Because it's your first healing tactic. Increase to 25, oh, sweet. Geez. We'll have to go in the field now and try to find Nanjong. Unfortunately, it could take some time. I was kind of hoping you would run into him the that, first that, time. That, that, I, that, I'll be honest, I, I was thinking the same. <laughs> Thank you! Alright. This guy is pretty weak anyway, so... I'm guessing Zhang Fei is not that good with, uh... No, he's got like 75 stuff. intelligence, so yeah, I'm not using tactics on him. Unless the enemy has like two intelligence. <laughs> oh, this is just a regular battle now. We capture Dan Zhang, and we want to convert him. I might be convinced to join your side for 80 gold pieces. So yeah, there are four scenarios that can happen whenever you try to convert an officer. Uh, he can either join you without asking for anything, that's usually the best scenario. 
Sometimes he'll ask for money. Sometimes he'll ask for a steed, which is why I got one. Or sometimes he'll outright refuse and say, I'm, I'm, lo I'm still loyal to my lord, fuck you. Not exactly those words. But yeah, there we go. We got Andron now. And we got a random battle as well. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> so, if you attack from the front, not only do you face the three brothers, but you face two other officers, which I remember being kind of strong, actually. You want to get rid of Zhang Jia as much as possible. So we'll actually use Wujian and uh Right, you're also useless, so just attack Zhang Zhao. Thank God for that. I do want to keep some TP actually to heal if need be. Which honestly might not be a bad idea. Kill some of the soldiers of Liu Bei. Ow. Should have maybe done it for Sit Chen Deng actually. Yeah, we'll be fine. Yeah, we'll be fine. Should be fine now. Oh, Jesus Christ. Live? Okay, we did it. We beat the yellow scars, everyone. That's chapter one. And gained a level for our progress. 191. 186. Cheng Nei. And 29 tactic points. I no longer need you, so give back your stuff to Mije and get benched. I'm tired of trying to rule. Please take this burden from me. No, I cannot. I am too uh, benevolent. Okay, sure. As it is a Chinese tradition to refuse a few times before actually accepting. It doesn't change anything in the game, but... One new Zhengfei, I now have a castle and a people, and a people to protect. He's not as powerful as Yu Bei in terms of statistics, but he makes up for it for uh, by with an higher soldier count, so there is that. And he comes equipped with uh, everything that Yu Bei had, though you do need to re-equip that stuff. He will usually be the fastest party member to go. Hey, Taokian is still here. He's sleeping. He's just sleeping. He's not dead. What do you mean? We're defeated. Betrayed by our own side. I'm fucking off over this mountain now. We're already seeing a higher soldier count here. But... Yeah... They're not intelligent. They're actually really stupid. You don't even need to worry about tactics. On the enemy, from the enemy side, anyway. You want to deplete the soldiers of Washong, though. That's without saying. Actually, you three attack. You two use Lian Huo. Yeah, he also hurts quite a bit. Ooh, nice job, Zhengfei. Should be good to go all out now. No big deal. Let's talk about Yang Jin. He's not that good. <laughs> That's all I have to say. I can do a little bit of sequence breaking. If 
you check here. Shituma! You are not supposed to know that the first time! <laughs> Just by having it in your inventory, it increases your agility. I'm going to give this to Guan Yu. Because it makes sense. There is a bit of a glitch you can do with these caves, actually. I might show that off later on in the game. Oh, goody. I wish I could get this guy right now. Just go all out on his butt. And hope for the best. Increase his defense. Sweet. Okay, we didn't get hit by any bullshit. Oh, sweet, level up. When you ask 217, 225. Kishu. 34 tactic points. No, I knew for a fact that you couldn't recruit Lee Ru at this point. God damn it, the chest is right there. Oh, good. Thanks, game, I hate it. Pretty good strength for this point in the game. Gonna use Shijin on yourself and everyone else attack Fanchu. God damn it, Jang Fei. Would you stop attacking Chen Deng? Jesus. I know it looks like a juicy target, but that doesn't give you the right, damn it. Okay, finally. Now we can go all out. The thing took a lot of damage, though. That was a double critical there. I remembered the sound effect. Oh god. Another strategist. He actually has kind of decent-ish strength. Let's try to retreat. Fortunately, we succeeded. God damn it. Oh gee. I think that's supposed to be Guo C, actually. He's not super powerful, but... Do be careful, he has more soldiers. Just gonna retreat for now. Leave us alone! <laughs> for fuck's sake! Please sue. Seriously? I'm not even gonna bother. Maybe that was not such a good idea. No. Oh. You know what? Sure. It's a lot of money, though. I mean, I do have quite a bit of money as well, but... I will want that money for equipment and stuff eventually. Fuck off. I love this game, but my god, the encounter rate is weird. Sometimes it takes a million years to get an encounter, and sometimes you get like five in a row. Also, I didn't mean to do that, but... I'm committed now, I guess. For some reason, he joins us here. He's actually alright. And uh, he's definitely gonna be a boon for this part of the game. In the meantime, let's go back. We desperately need healing. Uh, especially if Ziyangzu is here. Bye! <laughs> We do not want- I'm not even showing Jiaxu stats, just trust me when I say you don't want to fuck with Jiaxu right now. These guys are all that, so I don't care. Still all that, I don't care. You're still all that, I still don't care. Fuck off. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Okay, fine! God damn it! Leave us the fuck alone! Alright, if you want nothing, I'll take you. Well, nope. Get fucked. I'm Lubu, I don't believe you would find me as feeble as Washong. Okay, this battle! Say hello to the main warlord of the Three Kingdoms! Even though there's no Three Kingdoms yet. Lubu's dangerous! 
as you may have figured out. However, he does have one fatal flaw, his low intelligence. However, with him is also Liru, which essentially just compensates for this. You kind of want to try to go all out on Lubu first. Because he does a lot of damage. It feels so dangerous seeing Lu Bu attack you like that. If I can, I can't. I want to actually recruit Liru after this. Continue attacking physically. You have less strength than the rebel forces. When you drink faith, today you have defeated me, but soon I will return the favor. Oh, if only Liu Bei had been here, we could have recreated that one scene. Level up! 247, 258. Yay, yeah, whoa! We've we've already gotten our level 2 fire tactic, which, uh, trust me, we're gonna fucking need. Hello to the Master of Powders, everyone. Self-proclaimed, anyways. He's actually fictional! Gee, I wonder why! <laughs> no, it would be nice if we could find Lee Ru, actually. That is not Lee Ru. I don't care about Lee Jue. I said I don't care about Lee Jue, gay! Okay, seriously, Lee Jue, you're kinda grinding my gear here. Ow! Damn you! Freaking Lee Jue piece of shit. There we go. Now we're good. Prepare to fight Lee Jue. Didn't we just do this? <laughs> I'll use Lee Huo. See how much damage it does. Oh yeah, pretty decent. <laughs> you know, just a hundred soldiers burned. As Zurong and Guo Ji, who is actually Guo C. I don't think this battle is gonna be much of a trouble, honestly. You usually want to bring their soldier count below 100 before you go all out at this point in the game. Oh boy. Taeyong is another interesting case. He's actually decently strong and he's actually pretty intelligent. We want to be careful about him, and uh, hopefully I can run away from this. Thank God. Ah! We get the devil- oh, fuck. Okay, he just increases defense, thank God. It would have been really bad if- oh, lol ambush, yeah, whoa, you dead fucko. Speaking of Yehu, I <laughs> heard so much. <laughs> Maybe. Apparently, dousing you in fire as well, apparently. Sweet. Even more sweet. Fantastic! Please don't ask for money. Yeah! <laughs> Got him for free! <laughs> Fantastic! Welcome to the fucking tea! <laughs> this is not an easy battle! Which is why I just healed uh, Liu Feng a little bit beforehand. Honestly, both of them are kind of dumb, but they have very high strength. <laughs> Especially fucking Lubu. They actually have the same amount of intelligence. <laughs> Interesting. We want to concentrate on Lubu first.
Yeah, we want to concentrate on Lubu first. I mean, Dongjo is also hurting, but it's nothing compared to freaking Lubu. There we go. He's heavily nerfed now. Oh, you're gonna use the tactics. Everyone else attacks Lubu. Ow! It would do even more damage if I didn't have armor on. Trust me. How dare you attack the Master of Powder, you jerk butt! Master of Powder is gonna burn your ruler! Oh no, 15 soldiers lost from a rebel, yeah. You know what? I think we're good. Let's go. Dongjo is still doing a lot of damage, but I'm pretty sure we can heal in Luoyang? Unbelievable. Retreat back to Chang Han and regroup. Yeah, retreat back to Chang Han. Not before he actually burned the place down. There is a mysterious tile here. I found a small keyhole. We got the gem sword. We must return to Bo Hai once more and join our comrades. So long. Going to the wall. <laughs> Why you keep hounding me? I'll teach you to regret it. This would normally be a pretty dangerous battle. You will be using the gem sword on Lubu. And uh, sure, use a tactic on them. That the gem sword? I give much for that sword. Sure. Give it to me. You're too kind. Don't you, I had almost forgotten the meaning of kindness. How about letting me join your side? Sure. How may I serve? And there we go. If you go eight yard west and one yard south, you can find my Orshituma. We already did, Lubu. But yeah, now that Lubu's out of the picture, this fight is a joke. It, it just is. Oh god damn it, he healed himself. He's not good. I'm gonna keep Lobu benched. Oh, who in Liru learns Shuixing? I believe that's the next level healing tactic? No, no, no. We've got Dongmin and Fan Shu. Dongmin. <laughs> Fan Shu we've seen before. Other than his eye strength, nothing to worry about. Oh, we've done it. Once again, you can't enter here. You Fang, do you think you can occupy Changhan with such a small detachment? I laugh at your folly. Oh boy, we've got Jiaxu. Oh god, we've got Jiaxu. Oh god, we've got Jiaxu. Jiaxu is dangerous and is probably one of your first targets. And I think if you haven't recruited Lubu, he would actually show up here too. So yeah. As for Zangji, we don't talk about Zangji. Daozhu is the same as ever. He's dangerous, but not as big of a threat as Jiaxu. Don't even try to use tactics on him. It's never gonna fucking work. However... We should be able to use water tactics here. I'm curious to try it out. Oh boy. Ooh, that did very decent damage, honestly. So yeah, it's super situational, but if you can get the, the water tactics to pull up, do it. They are very powerful. Uh, you know what? No, you attack Jiaxu. The Master of Powder will keep sending the water. Ow! 
Yeah, Jiexu does the same. Which is why I want to get rid of him. You are going to be using an elixir on Guan Yu. And keep sending the floodgate on Dongua. So yeah, an elixir A is just a hundred uh, soldiers recovered. Oh, nice. It would be nice to find Jiexu, actually. Because he's an even better tactician. Yeah, where are the tactical points? Yeah, once Jiexu is down, we'll just uh, go all out. I think G is not gonna be a problem. There we go. Kill Dongshu. Now peace will return to Changhan. I'm surprised actually they used the word kill, considering this was a uh, Nintendo in the 80s, but there we go. Let's see how good you are. I'm sure you're great. Do I need to even say anything? <laughs> this is fucking terrible! Oh my god. Okay, seriously now. Oh my god! <laughs> what the hell? Are you... Uh, do you want me to use that smoke butt? Because I'm trying to fucking do it. This is ridiculous. So many bandits. Oh my god, it's Geeling. Oh my god, they strike first. Oh my god, 69 damage. Oh god, Lufan. Oh god, he strikes first. He's got the highest intelligence of this part of the game. You might say it's not that high, but consider his number of soldiers for a second. I'm actually gonna try on purpose to show them off. There we go. Yeah, Pirate Force. They're essentially pallet swap bandits. Not much different about them stat-wise, though. We've got Leibo and Shinji. He's not good at all. We don't even talk about this guy. The main target is Leibo in between these two. Actually gonna use Shri Jing. We are close to water. Why the heck not? Bam! Well, we are next to a town, so we should be able to uh, heal right there. That's the thing with Guan Yu, he's so versatile. Because he has strong tactics. <laughs> wow. Okay, all out attack. Oh, there's G Ling. And Zhang Zun as well. Jiling Stop the press is, is the target of being raided by Mike! Hey! Well done. I thought Zhang Zun would have been good with tactics, but nope, he's even more terrible. Dun da da Yeah, we should be fine. I say that just as I take almost a dead there. I still have yet to have someone die on me. I'd like to stay to stay that way, but uh, yeah, you're gonna have to heal yourself. I start to kill at least one of them, as uh, you're also gonna to heal yourself. And that's all my uh, tactical points. All right, everyone, live. Oh, there you attack me. Everyone live! Perfect. 
We did it. Yeah, the officers in this part of the game are just terrible in general, honestly. How dare you miss, Master Powder? How dare you? How dare you? Yep. Captured Geeling. And he joined. Look at the difference of buttoned up soldiers there. This is ridiculous. So, yeah, whenever you get to an higher threshold of the soldier count, the bar gets smaller and uh, it changes color to indicate that uh, you're in a stronger tier now. So, we've actually reached that point, apparently. Interesting. Oh my god, so many commander battles. Once again, useless guy, I don't care. God damn it. Of course they're attacking Guan Yu again. I said I don't care. Damn it! Okay, fine, we will kill you! Fucking Christ! I won! Yeah, we'll try. Okay, well, welcome, I guess. That's one less officer that's still show up here, I suppose. Leave me alone! You're not worth my time! I don't remember if I mentioned, but Lufan's actually dangerous. Because, yeah, if that fire tactics uh, hits, someone's probably going down. Let me go! Good lord, there's only three of them! Take them out now before they're ready. And uh, somehow they actually do attack us first. Well, damn it. Let's have a look at him. <laughs> That's all I have to say about that. Oh my god, we've got two officers this time. <laughs> yeah, pathetic. Let's let's crush these Very fuckers. Weak officers. Let us crush these fuckers right now. So yeah, now we actually have to fight Lufan. Yuan Shu is actually kind of dangerous. He's probably the main threat of this whole, this whole chapter. With... Uh, he's actually got this guy who is not as good, but he's still kind of a threat. And then there's Lufan, who is a uh, tactics incarnate, essentially. We're gonna use power pills. I kept these things for this occasion. We're definitely gonna make use of them. Uh, you don't have one, so... Uh, you're gonna attack normally. Use your power pill. Oh, sweet. Does uh, the power pill essentially what it does is it's a guaranteed critical hit. Which uh, of course is very good. Yeah, the first target is Yuan Shu. The next one we'll want to de deal with was gonna be Lu Fan. Yuan Yin is dangerous, but less so. Come on, go down already. Damn it! Okay, you healed someone else than yourself. Good job there. There we go. Uh, yeah, that did a kind of a bit of damage. We're very strong, but why the strength fails? Running is a good strategy. Goodbye, Guan Yu. You can actually let him go. If you do, it's gonna make a later battle much fucking harder. If you de decide not to let him go... Let me go! No. Let me go! No. Let me go! 
Yuan Shu was executed as his ambition came to naught. Beast returned to Nanya. So we fucking murdered him. Yuan Shu was killed and we were freed. By the way, they say that even if you let him go. <laughs> Zhang Fei currently has 50 attack power. Let's equip that trident, shall we? <laughs> he just doubled his attack power. <laughs> this is the only safe state I've done all time because I'm not sure if the safe system will work properly. I just wanted to show yeah. this. Yu Feng, I've been waiting for you. I'm Yuan Shao, the Lord of Boai Castle. I'll kill you and redeem my brother's glory. Prepare to die. Even if you left the Lu Bu Bench, he still will betray you here. Fantastic. We've been backstabbed. And of course he's stronger than he would have been in our party, because fuck you. <laughs> Yeah, that gives you a taste of what's coming next. <laughs> that reality never happened. <laughs> I'm pretty sure even if you don't recruit him, he will somehow show up here. These numbers are way higher than they used to be. <laughs> you know, when your less dangerous opponent is Lubu, there's a problem. Oh, Liu Bei, you're obviously no threat to me. So yeah, that's basically a... Um, a preview of things coming in this chapter. Nice touch, by the way. There's the Great Wall up there. In this chapter, we see our first officers over 1,000 soldiers. Every threshold of additional digit means it strengthens this unit. So you want to make sure to... Uh, Lower them be below 1,000 as quickly as you possibly can. So we've got Lu Guang. He's uh, stupid, but he has a bu bunch of strength, so he will hit hard if we don't do anything about it. We have Shen Pei, who is the strategist. He is not the best, but he can certainly do the damage on you. We have Galan. Uh, we don't talk about him. He's <laughs> I'm surprised he actually has a tactic. I think I'll send most of the fighter against Shen Pei first and use uh, Guan Yu to burn him. Most definitely the first thing you want to do is bring them below 1000. So this will already reduce their attack power, which is good. Honestly, don't even bother with the rebel forces until you deal with at least Shenpei, because he's probably the most dangerous target here. Because he's got tactics, of course. And uh, Zhang Fei with his trident will definitely be your boon here. Once the strategist is out of the picture, we'll be fine. Okay, now our next target is gonna be Lu Guang. Once Gaolan is left, I think we'll be able to go all out. Eh, you know what? I think we can go all out. Let's do with this. Yeah, we're good. We're fine. <laughs> we did it. Yeah, this is the first time we see a double house, honestly. Be wary of Yan Liang, Wen Hun. That's actually supposed to be Wen Shou, by the way. Oh, however, we did capture Lu Guang. Let's try to convert him. That's a little too much money, so fuck that. He's very average. He's not very good. I'm actually tempted to just go all out immediately, but uh, let's concentrate one round of battle on him. Oh, sweet. I did not think I would be round one rounding it. <laughs> oh, level up. Sweet. Wenyu is now 540 and Zhengfi 588. 
We learned Yanre. Oh, nice. We've upgraded our fire tactic, everyone. That is very nice. Seven grand. Cartridge. Oh, no. <laughs> Anyways, I believe we need to go west. Oh, God. Tian Feng is kind of dangerous. He's not the best strategist, but uh, he does have 108 agility, which I believe is more than most of our party members right now. And of course, he's got over a thousand soldiers, so even the, if his uh, 120 strength is average, it's still gonna hurt. And unfortunately, he's a strategist, so we can't actually use tactics on him. Not right now, anyways. Oh, God damn it, Geeling. I can't wait to be able to bench you because I will definitely be benching you. Oh, fuck's sake. This is one of those times I might be tempted to use uh, the power pill, but yeah, now we should be fine. There we go. Thank you, Zhang Fei. <laughs> Gokang's actually in a party. And he's got the intro letter for some reason. Gokang's not bad. Not the best. It's not bad. Use the gunpowder. Boom! Anyway. <laughs> okay, fine. I'll find this asshole. He's not great. Let's do one full round of... Oh, that's right! Yanre actually hits all enemies. We're gonna see that in action in a little bit. How'd you fail to burn a freaking rebel? But yeah, Yanre is willing to be very useful here. Okay, no, this time we're gonna run. This, I believe, is one of the main strategies of Yuan Shao. It's not actually Zhu Shu, it's Zhu Yu. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, for fuck's sake. Also, the ability just used their GC. I believe that's like the reflex spell in Final Fantasy. Don't use any tactics. But no, we're forgetting the fuck out of here. Anyways, back to town and let's not forget to buy. Oh, goody. They were not messing around. This guy is dangerous. Can I retreat? Thank God. He's gonna be your strategist for the next few portions of the game. He is pretty intelligent. If you don't go with a party of only five, unfortunately, your tactician will never participate in battle. And early on, you do want him to participate. Especially in this portion, honestly. I love God! <laughs> Thank you for Jimmy the donation. Underscore and underscore Jimmy underscore Lee underscore three tips three Canadian dollars. Wario is happy. Hey, when do we appear in this game? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much for the three dollars. And uh, this fight is gonna be pain in the ass. Well, Guan Yu and, Z and uh, Xushu will be using Yan Ray pretty much every turn. Until uh, Yan Yang and Wen Show goes down. And uh, the other ones will pretty much attack Xushu. Because, uh, except for maybe Xushu, uh, Xuyu, but uh, except for maybe Xushu, uh, tactics are not gonna work very well on Xuyu. And yeah, they do a lot of damage on your soldier. Yeah, it's supposed to be Wencho. Ah, oh, damn it, there's still over 1,000. 
Oh, there goes the rebel force anyways. Not that he was the problem. Unfortunately, you don't get access to Ansha until level 27, so forget about that. Oh, sweet! It, it didn't work on Wen Shu? What the fuck? Okay, we're we're in a better situation now that Yan Liang and Wen Shou are below 1,000. So uh, I'll have everyone other than Xu Shu concentrate on attacking, and Xu Shu will use Yan Rei. There we go. Tactician is down now. Might as well concentrate on one officer at a time. You know what? You're gonna defend, actually. We haven't really used defense yet. Fuck. <laughs> it's a good thing I defended too, because I kinda fucked up my inputs. <laughs> I fucked up. I fucked up. Yeah, this is one of the more difficult battles if you don't know what you're doing. Go ahead and bump one of your power pills on this guy. There we go. Yes. Say hello to Zhao Yun, our third tiger general. That's right. He is one of the officers that will actually increase his soldier counter level ups. So 507 may not look like much, but it's gonna go up. But yeah, those stats are way above average. Pfft, I'm not even bothering. This guy is now worth my time. Roof of concept. Not even bothering giving them the time of the day. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> of course I captured both. No. I don't want either of you. God damn it. <laughs> Ain't good for the all hot function. <laughs> Silly, silly, silly. Of course I captured him. I don't want him. Get fucked. Murder. Death. Kill. Alright. Oh god, it's Zhang He! Yay! He's probably the most dangerous soldier in this whole scenario. Yeah. A lot of damage. Fortunately, by putting him, uh, yeah, the power pills will very much help here. Oh, thank God. Surprise, motherfucker. Really? He's back with a vengeance. No. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> oh, this is a joke. It, it's, <laughs> I, I shouldn't do that. I shouldn't do that. Stop. Stop. Oh my god, no. No! <laughs> God damn it! Let me go! <laughs> Fuck's sake! I'm actually gonna have to retreat back to town if this continues. Holy shit! Two steps without an encounter. So we've got some uh, people we've already seen. 
He's not the best, but he is competent. You want to bring him down below 1,000 soldiers as quickly as you can. He's the strategist of the group, although I think he has close to the same intelligence as you want Tan in this. Which is kind of weird. We need to concentrate on both Yuan Tan and Tian Feng first. And uh, let's hope this works. Sweet, it actually worked on Tian Feng too. Oof. Very good first round, actually. Oh god. Yeah, that was to be expected. I'm actually surprised it didn't work on Zhang Fei, but I'll take it. Fortunately, I don't have any more power pills, so gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, Zhao Yun is actually gonna attack now. Yeah, let's have the actual strategist use fire. And that should finish off Tian Feng, too. Fantastic. Oof. Ouch. Yeah, I think I just got enough tactic points for this. Oh god, that okay, he's only got the uh, he's only got the other tactic, so we're fine. There we go. Let's finish this off. Ugh! We did it! Look at that experience points, though! Yeah, level up! Clearly. Guan Yu is not at 701. Zhang Fei is not at 775. Zhao Yun is at 574. I told you it would increase. And we learned Yin Xian, which is actually a new... Healing tactics, I believe it affects the whole party. Which is gonna be very good! This is the only time we meet Yuan Shang. He will never be roaming. Don't underestimate him, but he's honestly not that bad. Just go all out on him, use fire with your strategist, and uh, once you're done, go back to heal, because you're already in town anyways. We're next to an inn anyways. Fuck it. Bog while on the tactics! It'll pay off, I'm sure. Damn it. Only show you need freaking Yuan Shang. Alright. Oh, well, let's finish him off now. Yeah, we actually get free rations from this, too. You're too strong, I'll come back and kill you later. And he goes through the wall. Spoiler alert, he never comes back! My Yan is actually a weakling, so don't worry too much about it. Lu Zhang is probably your m biggest target here. Well, honestly, I wouldn't worry too much about it. Alright. You've got this tactic now. He deals everyone for... A quite a bit. It's a pretty good tactic. Especially if you use a good tactician for it. Ah, definitely worth your time. A trash officer. Your main target is this guy. The real danger is now. Aren't you Guan Yu's Yubi's army? You kill my brother Yuan Shu. Actually, it was Zhang Fei, but whatever. I'll take payment in your blood. By the way, even if you spare Yuan Shu, he still says this. Even though Yuan Shu does join in this battle, and god damn it. <laughs> That first strike is painful! <laughs> so here's the main commander of uh, the Yuan Shao army. Well, uh, Yuan Shao. <laughs> he is the strongest officer in overall in this scenario. For good reason. 
He almost has 2,000 soldier. This is your first real dangerous battle because you have to face four or five officer if you spared Yuan Chao. And then we've got Zhang He. We've met him in random battle. He's still as dangerous there as he is now. Yeah, do not underestimate this guy. Then we have Zhu Shu. He is a strategist. He is dangerous. Hi, Lubu. You suddenly gained in soldier all of a sudden, you fucker. <laughs> Drop him as quickly as you possibly can if you can. Honestly, there is a good chance that uh, Xushu will be relegated to uh, healing duties the whole time. Make sure you have revives, cause you might probably need them here. You concentrate on one target and hope for the fucking best. And in this case, our primary target is gonna be Lou Boo! <laughs> and yeah, we definitely need to heal here. But yeah, don't underestimate the other people. Ugh! <laughs> it's so fucking hard. It's so fucking hard. No, now's not the time to be missed. Oh my god. If it was anyone but Jushu, Zeus Shu would be dead now. Holy shit. Lobo also has 200 agility, so... Uh... <laughs> oh god! <laughs> Heels! Heels here! <laughs> oh my god! Finally, he's so under 1000, he's still a problem! Even when defending, that did so much damage! <laughs> Even under 1,000 soldier! <laughs> and now we can't even use tactics on them. Not that it matters, because the main tactics we've been using is heals. Oh crap, this is my last one though. Ugh. I can't even use it! Shit! This is a problem! I'm out of tactic points! Okay, oh no! <laughs> Why did it work on Zushu? This is so bad! This is such a terrible situation right now. Can I even use Yan Rei? Okay. I can, it's not gonna do much. Oh! Decent enough. Fortunately, it only worked on Yuan Shao. I really should have gone back and bought more power pills for Zhang Fei. I really should have bought more power pills. Oh my god. They have infinite TP, so you can't hope to outlast their tactics. Now, at this point, you pretty much have to concentrate on one target. There is nothing much else you can do. Dushu might not be the most difficult target, but because he has the most tactical prowess, he's probably the most dangerous here. Ugh, god, that's so disgusting. I mean, I have Resurrect, but ugh, it's still not a good situation. Yeah, I can't use anything here. 
yeah. Actually, go ahead and heal Zhao Yun. Right now, Xushu is relegated to be a punching bag. I'm sorry to say. Bye! Honestly, the next story is probably gonna be Yuan Shao. Go ahead and revive him. Yeah, resurrection. Uh... No matter how far you are in the game, revives you with 400 soldiers, so, uh... The late game, not as good. You might as well use it out of battle at that point. But right now, we're doing pretty good on that front, so... What do you mean there's no tactician? There is a tactician. Tactician is down there. Interesting. he's got multi-target fire which is why he's our next target Can you even use it before you get killed? We're gonna try. Okay, only 39. Damn it! You motherfucker! Of course! Ugh. What bullshit. Okay, I'm gonna go all out. If Zhou Kang dies, whatever. You have Yuan Shao's head. All of Yuan Shao and Yuan Shu's dead egomaniacal plans have been undone. Peace settles over the land. Oh, thank God for that level up. 799. 890 soldiers, 650, and we learned Jiru. Ugh, there is a house here. Until you are level 50, do not talk to this guy. What this guy does is he instantly gives you a level up. It would be useful, but it's even more useful if you're at level 50. Because level 50 is the natural cap. Unless you use this guy after your level 50. By the way, Jizu is actually a Goldwing location. That's almost a hint to come back when you're level 50 to get that free level up. True story. I'm sure. Say hi to Jinzuan and Gongzi. Fucking terrible. Decent-ish at strategy, but otherwise he's not super great. You do want to concentrate on him first. And uh... I never put back a tactician. All this time I've been running with no tactician. Great! I kind of forgot this point about the game. 
Because I don't think that happens in the sequel. Where if your tactician dies, you're just out of tactics. That's kind of stupid. Joyen currently has 50 attack power. Let's equip the bow. He now has 80. However, that's 80 times 2. The bow attacks twice. It is an extremely good weapon for this point of the game. Yeah! <laughs> now imagine using a power pill for this. And the bow also to targets if you kill your target with the first attack, I'm pretty sure. Anzuan is way better than he was in real life, that's for sure. Hey, he's got a unique portrait. I'm sure there's nothing mention about that. Doesn't look like a psychopath. And then there's this guy. We don't talk about this guy. He's not important in this battle. But yeah, it is time to use our power pills. Most definitely use your fucking power pills on this battle. Yeah, sure, attack him. And uh, you're gonna yawn Ray. Ugh. Yeah, even if they are trash mob, they do hurt quite a bit. Double critical, yeah. Jeez, they really don't like Zhou Kang, apparently. Uh, you're gonna use your last power, Bill. You're gonna assist with the, the tactician stuff. And you're gonna heal. And uh, let's hope to God that... Okay, <laughs> thank God. Oh boy. Yeah, even if Anzuan is supposed to be a trash, uh, trashy ruler, uh, he's uh, he's doing decent damage here. Fortunately, now everyone is under 1,000, so it should hopefully go easier now. We'll go all on the tactics for this turn. Weiyan is down. And Wang Zhong is down. But there's only the trashy ruler and the trashy officer left. And now there's only the trashy officer left. Uh. So we killed An Juan, everyone. And yeah, this is the only time we see him. He is not recruitable. Look at those fucking rations, though! Say hello to our fourth Tiger General! Unfortunately, he doesn't have as much soldier right now as he did during the battle we just had, but hey! He is pretty decent! For this point in the game, this is uh, pretty much one of the first... Uh, a general you can recruit that has over 1,000 soldiers, so hey, go nuts! Elder than Zhang Fei, everyone gets a fucking bow! <laughs> everyone! Everyone! So yeah, we'll get uh, 5 ring mail and 5 wooden mail net, and uh, yeah, I definitely have enough money to do that. This is our first major upgrade point in the game. Now we have 9 attacks per turn! <laughs> You know, no big deal. These brigands don't know what they're gonna hit yet hit. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> How many we gain a level two? Sweet! 
soldier. Zhang Fiz our first Tiger General over 1,000 soldier. Zhao Yun is at 736. Wang Zhong is at 911. Unfortunately, we did not learn a tactic. Wan Yu, my friend, let me show you to your sleeping quarters. We've been warned about this. This is a fucking trap. If you accept, you will be put at a very low soldier count against the next battle. No. You arrogant trash, it's time to teach you some manners. So yeah, let's fight them at full power instead. He's not that great, which is probably why he was trying to do this bullshit. This is the only time we see him. Pretty unremarkable. Unremarkable as well. They've actually got less power and defense than we do now. <laughs> it's gonna be sweet. Gonna be sweet. Honestly, the most dangerous target is Zhao Fan, but not by very much. But yeah, we've actually got good officers now, so... That's definitely gonna help. Note that Wei Yan actually did more damage than Guan Yu there. That's because he's got over a thousand soldiers. That actually matters. Get fucked, Joe Fun. Let's go all out. Not a problem at all. Not anymore. Well, time to eliminate some rebels. Powerful my ass. Powerful is called Lubu. You're just a fucking asshole. Who is it? actually supposed to be Liu Xiang? Yeah, Wei Yan's pretty much gonna go first all the time. No. Won't have had the chance to see Super Power Zhang Fei because he's under 1000 now. I'm sad. Still did pretty good, though. But yeah, we already fucked these guys pretty much, so let's just get this over with. No big deal! Zing Dao Hong is back for a vengeance! He's unchanged. Completely unchanged. Why is he here? Who knows? Who cares? However, there is new do with him. He's the only danger other than Shang Sha in this whole scenario. Also, he's still got Shi Jin, the first healing spell in the game. What the fuck are you doing? Let's go out while on power pills, though. Completely eliminate this threat from the, the world. Oh my god! <laughs> yep. We're very close to that, yep. Well, uh, we almost one-shotted this battle. Let's just finish it off. Check the area around me. Whenever you got that prompt, if you get into some uh, battle, you get this battle. He's got a pretty big pool there! The Fledging Phoenix! He's got a whopping 240 intelligence. You're not gonna be able to use any tactics on this guy. You use your power pills. He'll be fine.
Ah, oh, crap. Okay, use Jimion. That is a very annoying thing. That essentially nullifies your attacks. And unfortunately, that also consumed the power pill anyways. Piss. Yep. Other than Zhang Fei, everyone has consumed theirs. Goodbye, Pang Tong. You fight to settle Jingzu and restore peace here? Let me join you. Fuck yeah! You got Pang Tong. And a level up! When you has now over 1,000 soldier. 1,173. 833. What? Over 1,000. We learned Yixin. And, uh, yeah. Welcome to the fucking team, Pankton. Also, world map team change. Or uh, soldier count bar has actually changed color since, uh, Pankton has a way higher score than, uh, the other guys. Yuzu Ping is never home. Or is he? Because he's actually here for once. Your food actually drains faster the more soldier you get. Which, when you think about it, Makes sense! You have to say no! I think you have to say no and just wait. Say hello to the sleeping dragon himself, Zhu Liang! He has the highest intelligence stat in the game! This is where the difficulty will start to skyrocket a little bit. You notice how much uh, Pang Tong's soldier count is? Yeah, that's about right for the soldier count in the next uh, area. Now I believe we're in. Sh yeah, he's back with a vengeance. His actual random encounter once you step in shoe. This is such a dick move, and I love it. Look at that soldier count. Thank god he's not over 10,000, because he'd be even stronger. But he's still very powerful. We're using those power pills. We're gonna go back to town, but we're using those power pills. I knew this was gonna happen, but... Hmm. Nah, let, let's use a... Uh... Oh, let's use Yanre. Also notice that the rebel forces can reach 1,000 now. Yeah. 578 soldier. You do not fuck with... Did you do 1,600 soldier damage? Eh, yeah, we'll be fine. <laughs> Zhang Fei did like a thousand freaking soldier damage. He's still doing a lot of damage, though. Damn! And now his damage threshold has gone down significantly. Even if he's barely alive, we're still gonna do this. Ow. 
Get fucked, Lubu. Oh, my life comes to an end. My life was an insane betrayal. This is fortunately the last time you see him. Thank God. And apparently now we're in shoe. <laughs> Fuck. I don't want to fight these guys right now. Because, uh, yeah, they're, uh, pretty powerful. He's a decent strategist. He's a decent all-around fighter. Same thing for this guy. Let's just go. God damn it. Oh, God. Very powerful officer. Dangerous. Bad, bad. Kill. Murder, death, kill. I know I'm kind of under level, but Jesus, game. The bridge is right there. The bridge is right there. Or Liu Gui, if you prefer. Killer of Pang Tong, and uh, for some reason he has more intelligence than the other guy, but no tactics. That makes no sense to me, but whatever you say, game. We'll concentrate on Zhang Ren first. However, I think with Zhang Fei I can afford to use one. Ow. Yeah, let's uh, keep concentrating on this guy. You might want to use the elixir, but I think we can hold off on that for now. I think we can go all out on Liu Kui. Gotta concentrate on getting this this guy below 1,000 soldier. First and foremost. There we go. Now I'll we'll be able to go all out. Weren't you supposed to be incapacitated or dead? I'm guessing it might be a translation of another person, but who the heck knows? The actual tactician. Very dangerous. But yeah, obviously you want to concentrate on Wang Quan between these two. Oh, level up. Good. just gain the uh, over 1,000 soldier finally. Ling Tong and Zhu Liang learn Ong Shui, which unfortunately is kind of useless because it's one of those water only tactics. So yeah, you've got three battles before you can heal. Have fun! <laughs> He's pretty average. We've already talked about this guy. Your first target here should probably be Mangda, so... I will have Zhang Fei actually use a power pill. And I'm gonna say it right now, I'm probably not gonna be able to finish the, the shoes chapter tonight. Because uh, it is fairly long. I'm actually conserving my TP for the next battle. Yeah, essentially.
Okay, we brought Mingdo under 1000. We should be fine. He says not being sure at all. I don't know which side keeps missing, but it's kind of annoying. Yeah, I needed all my supplies for this battle. Yan Yan, very dangerous for this point in the game. The actual tactician, the not a as much of a threat guy of the team, will absolutely be using our power pills here. You will be trying to take care of the tactician. And, uh... Hmm. I could try Yan Ray, but it's not gonna do that much damage. Uh, bring some damage. We'll, we'll heal next turn. Yeah, we'll definitely have to heal next turn. And as usual, the, the Rebel Force is not even a problem. The power Pill and Fajang. Kill your soldiers! Give them the booze they need! God damn it! There we go. I really wish they would attack Pong Tong instead, because he can actually take this shit. Let's go all out on the healing here. Yeah, especially after that. Especially after that. Oh, thank God. There we go. I'll try using that on Zhang Fei, actually. Nice try. Ooh, attack power increase. Actually, that was a very good idea. Yanya is pretty much nerfed at this point, so... I'll have to use a heals. They are still being annoying, though. Okay, they're both under under 1,000, so let's go all out. Oh no, you Shijin. Good job. What do you mean there's no palace? I saw the palace right there. I think this door is very old. If you ram into it, it may break. Some people are not sure what that means. That just means pressing up a bunch of times. Uh, fuck no. God damn it!
Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? Hate my fucking life. I don't want to fight three random officers, for fuck's sake! I'm just trying to get to a place! Well, at least we got a level up. 1,500... 1,700... 1,200... 1,400... 1,300. And we learned Da Re, which means tactics are viable again, because that's the new fire tactic. No, get fucked. Oh my god, please! Leave me the fuck alone, I'm- <laughs> Are you fucking serious? I'm doing three step encounters! Damn it! Dare is actually really good! All I wanna do is go to the place. Is that so hard to ask? Apparently it is. Apparently it's too hard to ask! Yeah, sure. Have our steed. Welcome to the team. You'll be benched. I just wanted to come here. Okay, I am curious about something. I'm going to save state here. And uh, just quickly reset the game to see where it responds us. Oh, God. We respond in Guiyang. So yeah, if you don't mind, next time I'm actually gonna be loading this safe state. <laughs> I don't wanna have to trek to all that shit again. The experience will be skyrocketing pretty soon. Wait. I'm gonna guess two enemy territories are colliding here. It's that old NES thing, because... I should be facing stuff that is way stronger than this. He's probably target number one. Try to weaken Lang Bao. There we go, he's below 1000, so we should be fine now. Bam! Yeah, that, that did the trick. Okay, we've brought them both below 1,000, so that should definitely help. Water attack? What? <laughs> what? There's no need to protect against water tactic. Anyway, we'll still keep going against Wang Quan first of all. And there we go. But we can go all out now. Especially since I'm pretty sure Lang Bao is about to die here. He's still doing decent damage, but it's not even a big deal at this point. Go all out. 1756. Almost 2,000. Yeah, the number of soldiers will uh, very shortly skyrocket, so that's really cool. It is a full heal on one target. It is good, but at the moment, it yeah, the other tactic would have been better. Anyways, we've got another battle here. Well, here's some names you should be familiar with. Macho, Madai, and Pangdae. Macho is gonna be a problem. <laughs> 
It's very hard. He's also pretty strong. He is uh, gonna be a pain in the butt. I'll try to take Pine Day first. Although in the case of uh, you, you're gonna attack Machao first. Everyone else is gonna go after Pine Day. With the exception of you, which uh, you're gonna burn Madai. They're gonna hurt. They're gonna hurt a lot. Yeah, and this is exactly why I wanted to get rid of Pang Day. I didn't think he would actually have enough, uh... Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, thank God, it's just the Rebel Force. You're actually gonna try to burn Pang Day. Fuck. Well, there he goes. Down goes Guan Yu. You are our strongest attacker, so you need to keep going. Um... Yeah, you need to use the Resurrect on Guan Yu. Okay, that should weaken Madai at least a little bit. Ugh. I don't like that one bit, though. Oh, crap. That is not a good sign. You're gonna have to heal Giant Fei. Yes, please attack Pine Tong. Oh, God. This is why Pang Day needs to go down. <laughs> You're gonna have to try again. How is it missing for us? The love of crap. <laughs> this is a bad start. This is a terrible fucking start. Thanks, game. Thanks a whole bunch. Okay, at least you didn't consume that. Need to burn one of these fuckers. Ugh, of course. Fucking Jimmy. <laughs> Fucking jerk, stop doing that. Ah, we're in deep trouble here. Deep, deep trouble. Of course you do the crit, my goodness. This is the first very difficult battle I've really had. Even that one, uh... Okay, finally Pangde goes down. He 
Okay, you still have your resurrect. You're gonna have to try to revive Guan Yu. Oh, crap. You gotta be kidding me. Not gonna do that much damage, but you might as well. Oh my god, he does so much damage. Yuna has nothing. Yeah, I've got nothing. I I'm out of items. I've used everything on this fucking battle. risky, but we have to do it at this point. Okay, we're good. Jordan, my man. On all my years of war, I have never suffered such a defeat. It was not easy! <laughs> I would be honored to fight at your side if you'll have me. Of course! Da -da 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 -da. Who'd have seen this coming? Say hello to the fifth tiger general. Macho! Leon is... Surprisingly more of a strategist than anything else. More of a strategist. He's got Yan Ray. Kind of unremarkable compared to everything else we've seen so far. I think our biggest target first will be Liu Ba. So uh, both uh, Guan Yu and Zhang Fei will be using a power pill on him. And I think we can afford to uh, burn burn one of these two down. Burn him since it should be successful. Not more than that. Okay. Yeah, get fucked, Yuba. I don't think he even had time to attack. Yeah, this is not doing uh, nearly as bad of a damage as it did earlier. Yeah, I think our next target is gonna be Leon, then. You know, even you attack. Why not? Seven sixty one. Nice job, Zhang Fei. Yeah, we cannot. We we can almost just go all out now. Compared to that earlier battle, the damage done by these guys is pathetic. Just go all out. Yep, no big deal. Bird to fight Lei Tong. And Wulan, apparently. And we are to struck first. Yes, please. Attack Pang Tong. Really powerful in string, but otherwise unremarkable. A bit of strategies, but nothing too much. His intelligence is still pretty low. Lei Tong with this high attack will be our first target here. Yeah, even uh, Zhou Yun can get on it. Why not? Go ahead and heal yourself. You're gonna try to burn Wulan in the meantime. There we go. Angerang. And there we go! <laughs> One third Lei Tong. 
I think we can just uh, do a regular attack uh, stream on this, but... I might actually want to heal Zhao Yun before the next battle. I'll probably do that. I'm actually gonna do that. And have Pine Tong use one Fu on Zhao Yun. Oh no, not protection against fire. You know all the fire tactics I'm using. Hi, Liu Zhang! Jesus Christ, you have a big army. I forgot about that. On his own, he's pretty pathetic. Nothing too bad. Probably our primary target. He is kind of dangerous. But honestly, I don't think it'll be too much of a problem. So, yeah. Wu Yi is definitely our primary target here. So let's, uh, let's all ass on him. First of all. Yeah, that Tianri at this point is pretty pathetic. Your physical attack does hurt quite a bit, though. There we go. Next target, though, is probably Wang Lei. Yo, perfect. Excellent. And uh, as crazy as it might sound, I think we can go all out because Yu Zhang, really not that powerful. However, I might want to make sure that. Uh... Yeah, let's do one round of you two. Top yourselves up. You top yourself. When the else attacks. Let's go all out. She was settled by the Yubi's army. We did it, boys! And gained a level for trouble. 2002, 2278, 1637. I still don't know why Zhao Yun liked behind so much. Okay, 1869, 1716. Same for Zhu Giliang. We learned Jimian, which I believe is that annoying tactic they used earlier to block ourselves from attacking. And the smoke pot ran out. <laughs> I feel confident now that we can probably just walk this off. Oh hey, it's the fake Tao Tian. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, give me your weapon. Please forgive me, I made five beautiful swords from the horror you brought me and named them Bo Yi, Nu Long, King Long, Tian Guang, and Wen Shang. But a band of those yellow scarves came and stole them. There was nothing I could do. So, yeah, unfortunately, we don't get the awesome weapons. But they are the best weapons in the game. We will be finding them eventually. So it's an important region. You're the only two I can trust to govern it. Will you do it for me? No. So it's an important region. You are the only two I can trust to govern it. Will you do it for me? It's a Badama situation. You don't fight Cao Cao in this game. Guan Yu and Heng Fei, my old brothers, are under attack by the evil forces of Wu. I'm going to Jing to skate them. <laughs> He's not as strong as his father. However, he has this, the property of his father of the tiger. He essentially replaces uh, Guan Yu at this point. Say hello to our new frontliner. Yeah, the soldier count kind of went up again. We were at barely at the 4,000 at the last battle, and now we're in the 5,000. 
he's decently strong. He probably is the main target here. So they can't attack for this turn. Note that our attacks are not doing as much damage, and that's because the enemy has a lot of freaking defense. Go ahead with another Jimion. And Zhao Yun it worked! Huh! Not that it did much damage anyways. isn't costing too much. I'll keep going with that. Sweet! You know what? Go all out. Let's see how much damage he does. Not enough to justify it. We may have recaptured this castle, but the final victory will be Woo's. Will it now? <laughs> Just die. <laughs> Panjang is uh, your typical fighter. He's supposed to actually be Panjang. Hey, he's my cousin. <laughs> Not really. It's hard. Not too much into tactics. That's about it, really. But uh, I think I'll use the same tactic. Let's go with Jimmy on again. Is this cheap? Absolutely. Absolutely it is cheap. And you don't want you know what? I don't care. <laughs> Makes the battle so much easier. God damn it! We scrub of shoe, we want to have turns too, you assholes. Just, I'm sure what they're thinking. Anyways, let's just go all out. They do hurt whenever they can get uh, tell you Bay that way as an alliance with Wu. Oh, good. We know how that ended, right? Level up! 2,598, 2,283, still not 2,000, barely 2,000, still not 2,000, still not 2,000. Tuilu, we're officially uh, approaching the end game, and by that I mean the next two chapters are gonna be very fucking difficult. <laughs> So, uh, let me just get into an encounter in this area real quick. Go ahead and showcase a glitch. Now let's use a smoke pot. And we're officially in Wu territory. This is where things get difficult, folks. Let's go to this place. No, you might notice I'm not reapplying that smoke pot. And that's because of this glitch. If you go in battle in a previous area, and uh, don't get into an encounter before you go into a dungeon. You get the encounters from the previous area you were in. So yeah, this cave will be very easy to traverse, essentially. Apparently we're still considering Jing. I'm actually kind of surprised. We're no longer in Jing! <laughs> Thankfully, it's the weaker of the officers, but good lord, almost 10,000! <laughs> Did I mention this place doesn't fuck around? <laughs> oh no, he recovered like 10 soldiers. <laughs> Whatever shall we do? Oh, goody. <laughs> the pirate himself, and he has the strength to boot. Oh god, Ganning! And then there's Lu Su, who actually has a unique portrait. For good reason! <laughs> He's also really good! Since we're using Jimian, uh, Lu Su will be our primary target here. <laughs> Fortunately, that went out first. 
Oh god damn it, they're using my tactic against me. You fuckers. How dare you? They have infinite TP. I don't. God damn it. Ouch. Yeah, Gonning is still fast as fuck. So even red air is not completely helping us here. I really need to be using Jimion. It is helping reducing the damage by so fucking much. <laughs> oh, that's painful. Oh, that is so painful. At least Lucy's down now, but oh god. Okay, I feel better now. Holy shit. Thank God we're at a town. And yeah, I can't go all out until I bring him under 1,000 soldier. 4,000 experience points, yeah! 2,900, 2,600, 2,100. 2300, 2200, 2200. They learn Gui Wan. I need to make Pang Tong as my strategist. Here, show you! Ah! Primary target, very dangerous, extremely dangerous. He's got Han Sha. Han Sha, for those who don't know. Is an insta kill move! Yeah! Primary target! No questions asked! He's dangerous as well, but nowhere near as dangerous as freaking Zhou Should be dead by this point, but whatever. We need to kill Zhou We need to do this. Let's try to somewhat nerf the other guys. So you're gonna use Jimian. You guys are gonna use all the power pills we have. All of them. All of them. And it's not doing that much damage. Oh crap. We just wasted them. Thanks, asshole. Uh, this might be our first defeat. <laughs> God damn it! Yeah, that's on show for you. Just like that. Out of the eater. And uh, we still can't do shit, by the way. Because they're all strategists. What do you want me to do? Oh, well, might as well defend. The fuck else am I supposed to do? That Jimion is still going for them. Oh, you fucker! Oh, thank fucking Christ. We can finally re-attack now. Ugh, even just his physical attack is doing a ton of damage. Oh, goodness. Yeah, I, I knew the Anshas were coming. Oh my god, he one shot in Zhao Yun. What do I do? <laughs> what do I fucking do against that? Like, no, seriously, what do I do against that?
I might actually need to need to grind. I don't like that prospect, but I actually might need to grind. Okay, this Jimian ran out. Thank God. Uh, no, you're gonna attack. Gonna use Jimian. Gonna try to resurrect Zhao Yun. No. He just fully healed himself. This, the, the, there's no way. The, there is no way. There is no way. I can't do this. I'm gonna need to grind. They're back to full and they have infinite TP. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> Good. Yeah, we're dead. We're just dead. Which, if I remember right, means I lose half my fucking money. <laughs> Am I actually gonna have to learn to grind until level 31 now? I think that's what's gonna be have to happen. Oh my god. Yeah, thanks. You're kind of a jerk. You know that? What do I do? <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have view of game over here. I I I, I did say no take back, sees. <laughs> So this is what's happening. And once again, we can't attack. Might as well go all out. What the fuck else do I do? Even better. Yubi's army has been overcome by Zhou because he's a cheating asshole. Well, yeah, but they have a cheating asshole on their side, Yubi. What do you want me to do? Also, everyone's fucking dead! Good! You know what? I might just walk back from Shu to Jing just to grind. Also, I thought I would lose half my money, but apparently not. It's just that my allies did not get full resurrected automatically. Other than Zhang Fei and Zhang Bao and, uh, and the other guy. I have five levels to grind. Fucking hell, my life. So the problem with grinding is you might actually r risk the time of uh, running out of food. Wait a minute. Did I not get Ancha? I should have gotten Ancha this level. What the fuck? Kinda pisses me off to not have Ancha, to be honest, but what, what can I do? This line here, in the Japanese version, actually spawns really powerful rebel forces. Like 65,000 soldiers worth. And you can power level two there. But that doesn't happen in this version, so who cares. Zhu Liang learned Jinxian, which is the best healing tactic in the game. By far. It only costs 
4 TP too. And he deals everyone for like 10,000 soldier. You know what? For the first time in forever, I'm gonna buy some food. There we go. Oh, goody! Even better! Even fucking better! I guess he doesn't have freaking Ancha, but still. Just what I need. Not being able to control Zhao Yun. Random battle, by the way! Random battle! Oh my god, we're still Jin Xians. Fucking Christ. Oh my god, we finally got our attacks back. <laughs> Good. Fucking garbage. Oh, you thought I could be weakened? Nope. Here's all my soldiers back. Oh my god. It's so disgusting. And yeah, it costs only 4 TP, so why would I not abuse it? This kind of garbage happens. Alright, use your... Okay, thank god. Thank the freaking stars! Good lord, that was so not worth it. I still need to try to get these power pills to go through it out. At least he didn't use Jimion, so... Ugh, that's gonna hurt. Please kill him! Please kill him! Please! For the love of fuck! Oh! Oh my god! We killed Zhao Yun! <laughs> now the battle should be easy, right? Right? Guys! Oh my god! Oh, I didn't even notice my uh, Jimian hadn't drawn out yet. That's perfect. Oh, let's do it again! Thankfully, once again, didn't run out, so... Oh my god, stop, stop using this garbage. At least it doesn't hurt as much as Zoyuns, but still... It's still annoying as all get up. Oh my goodness, that was the hardest battle so far. <laughs> There's gonna be harder ones. <laughs> Please and thank you for the level up game. 4,300, 3,800, 3, 3, 3,200, 3,300, 3,100, same for you. 
Hang Tong and Zhu Giliang learned Shui Long. We got some stuff. Well, there was talk of Zhu Gijin. And immediately we can't attack. Thanks, game. Thanks. Thanks. I, I, I appreciate it. Unfortunately, it did run out immediately, but still. He is uh, pretty intelligent. Fortunately, he doesn't have Ansha. He has a lot of strength, and that's about it. Nothing to write home too much. I'll let you take three guesses as to which your primary target is. You said anything but Zugi Jin, what's wrong with you? Let's use these, because I believe these attacks upgrade our strength. They do cost a big bunch of TP. Oh god. Surprisingly, not as much damage as I was expecting, but still. With the Jimion, you're gonna heal. Arrow Nails attacks. I'm doing a little bit more damage, I guess. Until at least two Gijin is dead. Oh, nice. Nicely done there. Once again, not as big a threat as the other guy, but. Eh, let's not do too much stuff. Yeah, one last time. Take of Jian Kun and afterwards we should be fine to go uh, go all out. Actually, Jimian did not go out. So okay, now it did. Too little, too late though. Oh boy, it's Tai Chi Sir. And uh, he's got a unique portrait, so you know it's, it's a big deal. Gonna use Jimion. No fully lasts for a few turns. Nope, only one turn. We're gonna be going to another town anyways, but uh, definitely we need to bring this guy down below uh, 10,000. Because, yeah, he does a lot of fucking damage. And uh, Jimion did not run out, so we can just do this. I need to kill one of these guys before I start going all out here. And yeah, Daichi Sir should be pretty much nerfed at this point. Yeah, he's dead. Well, he's routed. I think we'll be fine now. Yeah, this won't be the last we see of him. Nope. I don't have a horse! Yeah, Thank you, Mike, the for the gift sub to horse, less horse. <laughs> 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 
Once again, I would really like to know how you find these accounts. By the way, that's supposed to be Lu Shun. I'm not sure why it's called Lu Shun here. But whatever. Oh, for the love of fuck. Oh, and now we're on blue tier health bars. gonna hurt. Not as bad as I thought. I don't think Zhu Sheng is that big of an officer. He does have a lot of strength, but that's about it. Jimian. Actually, no. Let's not do that. Let's go ahead and heal. One of your power pills to bring him down a bit. At least bring him down below 10,000. Asshole. We'll be fine, honestly. Yeah, that wasn't that bad. Okay, there's the place we're looking for. I'm not fighting you again. God damn it, Tai Chi C. Also, yes, there's lava in this place. Dragon Ball is 4284. 4242. I'm thinking about 42 soldier of damage per tile. Also, flashing warning, <laughs> I should have said. However, here's the best steel, L is steel in the game. God damn it. Let's do that again! Here's the best element in the game! The steel element! Uh, oh, Jesus! There's the guy I want to recruit, but uh, why is he with this guy? That's not as bad as I could have been. Already ran out. Okay, we did it. This might honestly be the only time I break my no safe state rule. Because I wanna get this guy. Capture Drew, you. Yeah, I'm gonna. Please do don't. Ask for a horse. Okay! Doesn't yes. ask for anything, even better. I don't have to break my safe, no safe state rule. Thank fuck. It is one of the strongest we've been to the game. Finally, we get one <laughs> of these fucking things. Yeah, there we go. That's on someone that's heavily armored, by the way. Simeon. Thank fuck. Unfortunately, that does mean I can't prevent the enemies from physically attacking anymore, but uh, that means I can stop them from using tactics. Which is a boon in the end game. That means no unshuffle of shit. Yeah, just go all out on his butt. We should be fine. I can't wait until our army gets over with 10,000 soldiers, because at that point we'll actually start to kick ass. 
To be fair, this guy is actually recruitable, so if you find him in the wild after this battle, go nuts and recruit him. By the hey, way, this is supposed to be Cheng Pu. And uh, Cheng Pu is more of a strategist once again. He's actually kind of dangerous. Cause he's got one Fu. Make him your first priority, or use Simeon, which is probably what I'm gonna do. Far from being the biggest problem here, he doesn't even have that much colder. So yeah, we've cancelled their tactics, which, uh, thank fuck for that. God damn it, it already ran out. Ugh, it costs a lot too. It is worth it, don't get me wrong, but it costs a fuck ton. So you want it to actually stick, if possible. Let's see, yeah, once Zheng Zhao is out of the picture, your next target is probably gonna be Chen Cheng Pu. Once Zheng Zhao is out of the picture, you should be okay not using Simeon anymore. Still hasn't run out. I'll take it. I will continue to take it and enjoy it. Once Cheng Pu is out of the picture, honestly, Bu Shi, don't, I don't think it's gonna do that much, so... We should be able to just this go all just... out after this. And yeah, we don't get any more tactical points. This is it. That's that's our tactic points pool for the rest of the game. 124. Honestly, other than high strength, he is kind of not that great. Beiji on Zhang Bao. Because that increases attack power. Oh, bigger damage than I thought it would be. Yeah! <laughs> Ow. Get fucked, one guy. I'm actually gonna primitively heal here. Yeah, it Ah. Oh. Yeah, for some reason he's been relegated to just guard a gate. You guys attack the rebel forces. It'll be redirected to uh, one guy whenever they're defeated anyways. I don't know why he only has two sol random soldier with him. But yeah, at this point, we won. Jesus, Zhang Bao! <laughs> Wham! <laughs> Prepare to fight Sun Yu. Oh boy! This might actually be hard. Lots of high level tactics, but nothing too bad. At least there's no instant heal. He's got Jimmy on, so uh, guess your priority is number one. And uh, I am oh. remarkable. They do have over 10,000 soldiers, so you might want to actually bring all of them down below 10,000, but. Mostly focus on Zhang Hong. That's basically all I can say. Put you on him. You're gonna use Simeon. You're gonna attack once this guy, and you two will attack Zhang Hong. Okay. Good. good, good, good. At least that did not do as much damage as it could have. Uh, uh, you're gonna keep attacking Simeon's him. Off. Yeah, I know. I saw. Don't worry, I paid attention. It happens sometimes. Oof. Nice Good job, hit. Zheng Bao. Yeah, Sun Yu with his over 10,000 soldier is definitely hurting. Uh, yeah, you keep targeting him. I don't think Simeon ran out, so actually you can, uh, you can assist with the attack here. Yep, it died and ran out, which is perfect. What's not perfect is Zhang Bao missing. I 
And it's still going, so let's actually have a round of healing, though. Stop missing! Ah! You missed! How could you miss something that was three feet in front of you? All oh, damn it. Uh, right, you need to continue on this guy. Simeon is up. Once Ooh, again, once it. Zhang Hong is out of the picture, we can stop doing that. Dub. Still going. Okay, it's below ten thousand, so that should at least be a little bit better now. Below 1,000 there. Simeon ran out. Bring it up. Oof, and it's a good thing too, because he was about to use Jimion to fuck over my physical attack. Our next target is Sunyu, but he doesn't have anything too bad. Other than Yijin, but that just paralyzes for a few turns, so that's not too bad. And it doesn't always work. Ah. Well, it's a good thing I'm not using strategy on you, so that's kind of useless. I'm actually gonna go all out. Sun you down and I used uh, another Jinzian just in case. And now we go all out for real Z's. Goodbye. A 10,000 experience points. We're just swimming in experience now. 7,000 soldiers. 6,200. 5600, 5200, 5200, 5200. Hi, Looming. I do believe this is the only time we fight Looming, but he does have a unique portrait. And he comes with the uh, usual assortment of bullshit. He's got one foot to fully heal himself. He's got Jimian to stop our physical attacks. And of course, he's got high intelligence and 199 agility, so he might actually pull this shit off before he can do anything. However, uh... he is alone, which is important to take note of. But since we are in a town, we might as well uh, spam our tactics. And that's why I needed to stop. Fuck. Of course, now I'm totally planning for my Simeon to run out and his Jimian to not run out. Actually, neither of these things happened. So I guess we're just defending because there's nothing we can do against this guy right now. Simeon ran out and of course his Jimian did not run out because why would it? Jimian run out, thank fuck. It's still going. 
We're gonna destroy these rebel forces. Might as well get rid of them. Nope, you're not using that. Cause they're just taking time away. Fuck you, Lume. You are stronger than I expected, but Taichi C is stronger still. And he goes through the wall. There's a lot of people going through walls in this game. Alright, thank you for everything, Pang Tong. I do believe he should be coming with everything. Yeah, he comes with everything that uh, Pang Tong had on. And he does have Ansha. What are you doing here? You farmers don't have a chance against us. Go home. That's right. We're fighting generic pirates. And uh, they're actually kind of strong. Despite being generic, they have... Uh, Somewhat decent stats for being pirates. Yeah, we're doing a crap ton of damage to these guys. Make sure you bring all of them down below 10,000 and then uh, go one by one. And you should be fine. This is not that hard of a battle. Ah, oh, come on. Once you're down to two, now is the time to go all out. Yeah, nice experience for simple pirates. Which actually gained us a level. 7,969 done. Nice. 6,500. 5,800. 5,900. 5,900. He gave up. It was a chaos and others. The mess of brigand. We promised to change our ways. Make your promise? It's a sword named Young King Long. Is it for good purpose? Oh, we will. I'm gonna give this to Zhao Yun. King Long is another one of the ultimate weapons in the game. So yeah, it is very much worth it. The correct path is down here. And then hop. And then get ambushed by Ding Fang. And soon you. God damn it. Uh, you wanted to die so badly, you just had to say it. Before Gianye, we've got three gates. Run home and tell you how terrible Sun Yi is. Fortunately, he's alone, he's unremarkable, he's kinda terrible. I might just go all out. Just heal if I need to, essentially. So essentially taking a quick turn to heal here, and death. Uh... Oh, let's keep going. Second gate. Prepare to fight Jotai. Who is not alone this time? Bad? <laughs> just... Is there anything else to say? He's just bad at this point. Why would you have she's in At... Almost the end of chapter 7. I don't get it. Weirdly enough, the main target is Jotai. But I think once we've broken him down below 10,000, we should be fine. for damage. LOL. Just a just-in-case heal. 
That way I don't have to do it at the start of the next battle. 68. That's so pathetic. This is like... Dong Zhuo area type of power here. What the fuck? Oh, hey, we still got a level! Level 35, 8800, 7800, 7400, 6500, 6700. Third battle, let's go! Where's my enemy? This, however, could be trouble. Honestly, I don't think it's gonna be on the tactical side. It's probably gonna be on the strength side, and they have the soldiers to boot here. They do have a tactician, but... Unremarkable. The main priority will be to try to bring everyone below 10,000. So, uh, let's get started on that, I suppose. We'll try to split the damage evenly. Failure, failure, failure. Somehow wins for 100 soldier. Yeah, Yanre at this point is pathetic. I'm sorry. I'm gonna use U Uo Shen because I believe that's a pretty high dealing uh, fire tactic. Yeah! Get fucked. And yeah, that was just pathetic. I think we can go all out a little bit. Let's watch out for soldier count if it gets too low. Go ahead and have a kneeling tactic here. 64 soldier. Eh, that it. Die. That's so much experience. I love it. However, this next fight is gonna be harder because it's actually a two-parter fight or first one in the game. Tai Chi C is very powerful. He doesn't have any tactics, but his uh, strength sure makes up for it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. And then we've got Lu Shun, which for some reason has a generic portrait. But he's got a lot of good tactics. This might be a fight where you want to try to unshot him with uh, Zhu Liang if you can. And hopefully, Simeon connects first. <laughs> okay, good. And he wanted to use Jimian, so that was a that was a good use there. Oh, perfect! That actually did not go again. With Jolion, I'm actually gonna use Yuo Shen just to get rid of the rebel forces. Not surprised it fell on Lu Shun. Cause yeah, that's the thing. Lu Shun, unlike other strategists, is actually strong in attack power. And it's a good thing that Simeon did not come back because he was trying to fully heal himself. Oh god! Your arrogance will find you dead. Listen to this jam. Welcome to our first major boss battle! 
This is Sun Chuan! <laughs> he almost has 20,000 soldiers! No fuck with it! We essentially want to try to uh, make sure that uh, we nerf his freaking tactics and uh, let's try to thin out the rebel forces too while we're at it. Perfect. No fire for you, Sun Chuan. Yeah, not surprised it didn't work on Sun Chuan, honestly. I just did that just to remove the rebel forces out of the way. Simeon ran out, unfortunately. A good thing, too, once again. He wanted to use Jimion. Shit is getting real here. However, I am kind of cheesing this boss with the uh, freaking Simeon. Sun Chuan, the last of his line has died. We just defeated Wu, everyone! And gain a level! Ah, oh, almost 10,000! So close! Attack away from Jianye Castle of Wu. Northeast of here. That's a bit of a mince translation, but essentially, uh, from here. Attack northeast from here. Sanzian, you have less soldiers than uh, frickin' uh, Sun Xuan, and you're pathetic. I'm not even gonna bother trying to do anything good against you. Ooh, when? Meh. Pathetic little wretch. For some reason, Zhao Yuan is just here and is pretty pathetic. Despite having a unique portrait, which is kind of sad. I'm gonna use Uo Shen to get rid of the rebel forces as much as possible. Ah, oh, that actually worked. There's a big problem when you can just uh, all out attack a boss very quickly like that. But we still have a castle to go through. And it's Zhang Liao! Who also has a unique portrait. Because it's Zhang fucking Liao. And he shows that he's Zhang fucking Liao. And he's got Ansha! Guess who your first priority is? And there there's Kaozan. Uh... That... That... I mean... Average, and we need to use Simeon. Thank God he did not use Ansha at the start there. Protection against water? Oh no. I actually wanted it to work against Kaozen. I'm surprised it uh, worked against Zhang Liao, to be fair. You two will attack Cao Zen to bring him below 10,000. Because of that! That is exactly what we needed to bring him below 10,000. Okay, we should be fine now. As long as Zhang Liao dies. Ugh! Thank God for Simeon. He tried to kill one of us. And it probably would have worked. We will be healing after Zhang Liao is defeated. Another end shot attempt. That's two soldiers that would have died if I wasn't using Simeon. And a level up to boot. Which means... Shang Bao now has 11,000 soldiers! Almost 10,000. Almost 10,000. Not quite 10,000. Not quite 10,000. I'm Jiang Wei of Wei. Zhu Liang is a true master of strategy. I have come, hoping to learn from him if he'll well of me. Of course! 
You won Zhang Wei in your party. He will be replacing Zhou Yu. <laughs> Ooh, look at these stats. Not only is he good in strategy, he's actually good in battle. Zhang Wei is the unofficial sixth uh, tiger general. If you want to have the easiest time ever, give him the fucking red air. He's gonna have max stun agility now. Which means he will always go first. So yeah, we've essentially got our final party now. Jiang Wei is definitely gonna be a boon. He has the same soldier growth as Zhao Yun too. And yeah, I'm putting Wang Zhang behind because he has the lowest uh, soldier growth. Where they just sort of run into each other and people die. Yeah, it's essentially you just go on the all-out offensive and just use attack over and over again without actually having to choose it. It's actually pretty useful and pretty innovative for an NES game. Oh yeah, here's the oddity of Wei. Because uh, in the actual story, Pangdi does end up joining Wei, but um, he retains the stats he had in Shu. So he has no fucking soldiers. This is kind of a joke. One step encounter, by the way. Oh god! This guy might be a bit more of a problem. He's got Ansha. You're doomed. That's kind of why I bought all these freaking power pills. And it's a good thing I actually uh, struck him first. Oh, let's just hope we don't get unshut to death. And of course we did. Thank you. And this guy is actually so intelligent, he killed my strategist. Fantastic. He's totally gonna use one Fu, isn't he? Oh good, even better actually. Ugh. So annoying. Who's that Jim? Honk. There's no reason to actually attack because we won't be able to do shit. Oh, it's Yishin that actually went out. Shit. Fucking Gujia. There we go. Please kill him now. Thank you. Okay, can I not meet Gorgia now this time? No. No, even worse! <laughs> God damn it! Uh, good. Good, good, good. Wait a second. Good. I know what you're fighting. Let's get the fuck out of here. You're fighting Rebel Curse! Indeed. This guy, yeah, he has a lot of soldier, he's also a chump, so let's just go all out. And here's Pang Day in all his uh, shoe soldiers glory. <laughs> One shot at Pang Day, because why the fuck not? He's got Ancho, he's got Jimian. Yep, 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 yep. Needs to die. Needs to fucking die. Simeon did not go out, so let's actually keep going. There we go. This could have been bad, but it wasn't. Sweet! Level up! 12,000 soldiers. Over 10,000. Over 10,000. Not yet 10,000. Over 10,000. 
Not yet 10,000 and way too low for being in the active party. And uh, here's Salozy again. We just fought you, bro. I'm gonna be using power pills. It's Chimion. Yeah, he tried to kill one of my officer. It's a good thing I did that. Because he probably would have succeeded. He tried to kill another officer. However, that was just a warm-up. And that's a big problem. Because, uh, yeah. This fight always starts with the enemy catching you off guard. Which is a big problem. The Emperor of Wei. And uh, he's got the stats to boot. 250 agility. So unless you have red air on Jiang Wei, you're not going faster than him. Fortunately, I do have that, so I should be fine. He looks very pissed. And of course, well, there's the good ol' eye patch as well. Our primary target is Selby, so let's actually get on that. With some power pills. And you're gonna use Shimyan. And fortunately, they don't do 10,000 damage now, thanks to our plate mail armors. Again, Zhang Bao is already equipped with almost the best stuff he could have, so there is that. Uh, reapply Shimian. Yeah, it's so it still hurts. We'll have you use Jinshan. And more Simeon. And hopefully it actually sticks this time. Good, good. Okay, this is gonna be a problem. But don't think yeah, I can't cast it anymore. So, uh, this is a damage race. We need to kill Cell P as quickly as we possibly can now. And it's not gonna be easy. I predict game over. Honestly, it could happen. It already has. Unfortunately, once again, he did not fully heal himself, which is good. Keep it that way. How is the rebel force going first? Oh, I thought he had one, foo. Okay, I'm kind of glad he doesn't. That's actually not that bad. What is bad is this fucking asshole using this tactic. He's definitely our next target. Oh my god, really? You guys start on that. Jiang Wei, as long as you don't miss, should be able to take him out. There we go. Oh god! You they still hurt! It still hurt a lot. We need to uh, defeat Zhou Dun now. If we can somehow bring him de below 10,000, this should at least be more manageable. I'm kind of hoping that this camp will have a... a pseudo inn inside, but I wouldn't count too much on that. The thing is, our soldier count is still relatively low, which kinda sucks, actually. It would also help if we had access to more ultimate weapons, but uh, they're not available until the next town. Let's do this. 
I don't have any ways to heal, so I have to hope that no one dies. Well, I'm glad he kept missing. Kills here. 14,000. Wan Jing at 12,000. Jiao Yun at 13,000. Ma Chao finally breached the 10,000 threshold and it's actually at 11,000. Yang Wei at 13,000. Zhu Liang at 11,000. And Wang Chong also breached at 10,000, just barely. They gained about 2,000 soldiers this one level up alone. For level 39, we're gonna start skyrocketing in soldier at every level up at this point. You have Jimian and one fu- uh, You're gonna make me apply myself, I, we can't have that. If he uses Jimian, I'm running away, by the way. And I'm running, because fuck Jimian in random battles, because it prevents you from attacking. Run away! Run away! Another Jimian asshole. All I know who my first target is. I guess we're using Simeon. I don't wanted to keep my resources. I might just have to get stronger here. We don't feel the strong thwelling in our party. <laughs> <laughs> it's just in fucking ghosts and goblins. <laughs> I don't think he would want to play that. No. Well, Halloween's right around the corner, so... Uh, uh, no. Fuck that shit. 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 I'm gonna fuck have to go shit. back to town. Oh Probably my god, this is even worse! Fuck this! No! I'm not <laughs> fighting two <laughs> strategists! <laughs> Stop oh, giving three. me wine con! <laughs> can Wang can? Yes, Wang can. Yes, he can, and it's fucking annoying, especially Jimian. No, 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 absolutely not. Fuck my life. Oh, New Robert. Of course. I'm gonna have to go back to town immediately again. I'm calling it right now. I'm not fighting four of these assholes. Zhou Dei. <laughs> You're not that bad. Let's just go on. If I can get more of these encounters and not the other one, that would be great. So you is kind of unremarkable, actually. Even worse, somehow. So honestly, I might just go all out immediately. Which is weird, because you usually don't want to do that in commander battle. But this is the point in the game where we're getting kind of strong. And uh, whenever you see a pathetic battle like this, just go all out. However, I will take a quick... Actually, no, not even. We'll just go all out for a bit. If we get start to get uh, someone below 10,000, then I will go ahead and heal. 11,000 nice experience experience. points from this. And a level up. Nice. Nice. 15,000 soldier. 13,000 soldier, 14,000 soldier, 12,000 soldier, 14,000, 12,000, and 11,000. But, of course, we're not done yet. They are not good. Same difference, different coat of paint, I guess. Just go all out. However, no worse is yet to come. Uh oh. We meet again, but this time I'm ready for you. Are you? He is not fucking around. He is actually ready for oh, us. Shit. And again, he gets a first strike too. You can tell because you can tell it's serious because the health bars are green now. Cao Zhang, who uh, for some reason has more strength than Macho? I don't get it. The other son of Cao Cao, who's also supposed to be dead. Um, he's kind of bad. He's almost as unremarkable as Cao Hang. Since Cao Pi has a uh, Ansha and all that bullshit, well, take a wall fucking guess who's our first target. Batman. Yes, let's <laughs> pretend that Cao Pi is Batman. <laughs> I'm Batman. Fortunately, did not use his tactics. 
pills here. Damn it. It already ran out. The good thing Jiang Wei is very fast. I almost thought you said very fat. And I got really fast. worried. Yeah, fat. He's fat. Can't he's fat. <laughs> There's no government. Oof. We oh, avoided that freaking Ansha. Honestly, once Cell P is out of the picture, you can probably go all out. I almost think he, I almost thought he yes. said it was Fantastic. pills instead of pills. Same rule as the previous battle applies. If you go below 10,000 soldiers, start healing. As long as you have enough tactic points left, anyways. Always have the person with the highest uh, intelligence do that, though. In this case, it's Jiang Wei, so... Simayi's army has arrived! Simayi, welcome! Oh. I'm glad you finally arrived! Selpi, I must explain why we didn't join you or sooner. Simayi attacks! Oh, Simayi, you... Well, Selpi, I made Simayi it attacks. despite your directions. You betrayed me! Simayi oh, attacks! Shit. Treachery! Yeah, retreat! Go. You can't run, you die here. Simayi oh, attacks. Here. But why? Shang Bao, I have killed Selpi. I'll give you his head. But I claim a way for my own. Take the head back to Gianni Castle. You can't defend against Simoyi's thunder. We're back in Gianni again. We're in the final chapter now, everyone. We're in the home stretch. Oh, right. Simoyi's thunder tactics is one of the tactics in Sun Zi's book. I know the counter spell. Up, up, down, down, left, right, up, down. Talking to Guan Suo is actually a sequence trigger. If you don't learn the code this way, even if you do know the code from having played previously, I think you just get fucked if you still do that. I wonder if Capcom knew what they were doing when they decided on that code to uh, do that negation there. They had to know. You wanna join me, right? Especially good horse. Well, I have two of those, so here you go. By the way, I do believe I might as well mention this now. You have about a five second window to enter that code before you get zapped again and sent back to all the way back to Gianye, so don't fuck this up. You biz army, you can't stand up against my thunder. I thunder fell? Give it up. Then brute force will suffice. Give it a thunderbolt. Ooh. My. Give it a God. That is a big <laughs> soldier count. <laughs> yeah, what? there's a good reason for that. There is a very good reason for that. My God. There is a very good reason for that. Say hello oh, see, to the master not... strategist of you. Oh my god! Yeah, this is Simayi! I see you have found the war mech of this game. Uh, <laughs> no! I found the final boss, actually. However, we uh, fight him more than once. This is the first time we fight him. Indy, what the fuck? How are you still alive? Here's Dion Wei. Use all of your power pills on Simayi. All of them. All of them. Simeon has a tendency to run out, but I'm glad it didn't, especially considering Simayi's high intelligence. But yeah, everyone goes against Simayi, and I'm actually gonna use one Wushan to potentially kill the two rebel forces. Not even surprised that didn't work on Simayi. All the pills! All of them! Yes, Simeon is still up! All the pills! All of the pills! <laughs> God no, damn it, I didn't mean to use defend. I actually meant to use another power pill with Jiang Wei. With John Wayne? No, Jiang Wei. That's a difference. Yeah, John Wayne. <laughs> <sighs> John Wayne. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm still gonna use Simeon here. How are these fuckers attacking first? Oh, fuck you. Fucking Jimion. Of course, of course, of course. Absolutely. Fuck you, game. We're already Jimion, you asshole. Oh, come on, run out, you piece of shit. <laughs> Why is the game lagging now? No, you're not using one foo, you asshole. Oh my god, run out! I hate Jimion so much, especially when it's used by this asshole. Oh my god, please run out! Thank you very much for running out! Good mm. god! Let's heal again! Penetrated much further than I thought possible, but it's not over yet! Oh no, oh, it's shit. not over yet! But we do get that about 30,000 experience points, no big deal. <laughs> Which means another level up. Langbao is not 17,000, 15,000, 16,000, 13,000, 16,000, and uh, Wang Chong is at 12,000 because he's an old man. Kinda weird, this town actually does not have a uh, sound of going in and out of a town. Weird. Oh no, I'm ambushed by rebel forces. Oh no. Whatever shall rebel I do? Curves. They're rebel only doing curves. less than 30 damage. Oh no. Can I do more than one step with an encounter, please? We're gonna murder these fuckers. <laughs> I'm noticing that the healing is not as good as it used to be now. I mean, it's still good, but it's not as good. <laughs> oh, it's totally fine. I don't know what you're talking about. Everything's fine. No, <laughs> nothing is fine. Oh, no. thank God. And I'm no, actually gonna no. use Samion. Just to be sure. Yep, he tried to kill someone. This guy, I am actually gonna recruit because fuck Ansha users in random battles. Or one foo user for that matter. Sigh. And he used Jimion at fucking six soldier. Fuck you. Ooh. We captured him. Join me. 14,000 gold. Go for it. Never get into a random battle again. <laughs> I love gold. Oh boy, this is gonna be fun. <laughs> Rebel underscore Thank you for the one dollar. One Canadian dollar. Wario is happy. Rebel curs. Rebel curs. Rebel curs. Rebel curs. Rebel curs. That is what Rebel we are curse. fighting. Rebel curs. Rebel curs. Rebel curs. Rebel curs. Rebel curs. Rebel curs. Anyways, here is Rebel the curse. king wearing one of the Rebel ultimate curse. weapons. Rebel also, curse. it said diarrhea Rebel for some Rebel reason. Curse. I'm not Rebel sure curse. why. Rebel but curse. yeah, this Rebel is one curse. of the ultimate Rebel weapons curse. in the game. The halberd. It is the strongest oh, weapon in the game. With the number one on it. The highest you can reach in the game. 5,600 <laughs> damage. Yeah! I don't want to use my freaking thing. Stop fully healing yourself, you freaking dick. Yeah, we've got two more gates here. I'm not sure why this battle is even here, because this guy is pathetic. I'm actually just gonna go all out on the commander battle. He's back, and he's not alone. He still has the same oh, stats. He still has one foo. Oh, he still has Jimion. He's still an asshole. Oh, oh shit. Here we, we go. Go but he's not alone. <laughs> Here's another asshole with Jimmy on and one food. This is Yang Zhu, and uh, you know what I think about assholes with one food and Jimmy on, so we're gonna 
try to stun lock them as much as we can. Probably the easiest target of the bunch. Our main target is gonna be Simoyi. And afterwards, it's gonna be the other guy. The only annoying thing he can do is Eugene, and it's honestly not that bad. Especially compared to, you know, getting stopped in your track completely. <laughs> Unfortunately, I am kind of out of power pills, and uh, we did use a lot of tactics coming here, so I only have a few Simeon available. Okay, sweet. Simeon did not run out. He still does a lot of damage, even with his physical attack, though. As for strategists, he's got a lot of strength behind him. I love that the Simeon is still going. And there, down it goes. Let's, we have some tactic points left, let's reapply it. But yeah, did I, and did I mention that Simoyi is fast? Yeah, he can, even with the red air, he can still go faster than Jiang Wei. God, it ran out immediately again. That's not good. That's my last one, actually. Kind of a problem if it do, we don't kill him before it runs out again. I have to hope for the best now. And we're fucked. We're fucked. We're absolutely fucked. Because now they prevented us from attacking. They're gonna fucking recover him. It's Ultimax. It's gonna be great. Love this. And of course it... Yeah. We are completely screwed. I might as well just go all out. Because <laughs> there's nothing I can do. To prevent all this shit. So yeah, this might go to a wipe, actually. Which means I have to go through both caves again! Yay! <laughs> I love Jimian! Fucking assholes! Oh dear. Rip. And yeah, Jang Bao is dead. I didn't even have time to go back and heal him. Whatever. We're dead. <sighs> Goddamn Simai and you're way too fucking high <laughs> pool of soldier. Yep, Yubi's army has been overcome by Simai. Time to go through both games again! Huzzah! Wang is going to get murdered. <laughs> Watch me as I drop a leg drop on them, brother. <laughs> you can't dis disappoint the little oaksters out there wanting the, the rebels to be crushed. That shit ain't good for none for my digestive system, brother. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> What is even going on? <laughs> We're digging up some rebel heritage, brother. In that place. What fresh hell did I just want to kill? Yeah, I'm not sure We're you want to know. <laughs> you just came in to the Hulkster being a bitch. There is a special property with this guy alone. We can recruit him. He is supposed to be showing up in a future battle, actually. But if you recruit him, if we recruit him in, uh, he's not gonna be in that battle. So yeah. So have my horse. Here you go. So by doing this, you skip a battle. No, it's not skip. It's not skip. It's just that he's not gonna be showing in that battle. I never thought of Gaggle as a unit of Mr. Men upon assholes. <laughs> oh man, I gotta put my dirt back. Oh god. Well, no, you could be like Psych and shove jerks up your ass. What? <laughs> I, I don't even want to know. You know what? I don't want to know. It's Psych. That's all you need to know. <laughs> <laughs> Look, he's the one with demons on his butt. Oh my god. Don't die. I'm gonna Don't die. die over there. I'm gonna die. Don't die over there. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs>
What a good fucking time to have the cups. Pretty much the best I can do. Oh my god. Jeez. <laughs> Alright, Simoye take two. We have a bunch of fucking power pills. We're all gonna use them. I have most of my tactic points. Also that, apparently. <laughs> Oh man, this is so annoying. Welcome to my world. Thank you, Ji Jiang Wei, for being the fastest character with red hair, and yet still not going before these assholes. <laughs> Can this hiccup go away? I'm not taking. Feel oh, thank God! He tried to <laughs> fully heal himself, the fucker. <laughs> <laughs> Our next target is Yanju, and once we take care of him, we'll be fine. Concede! Concede, damn it! Give up! My Simeon is still going! Concede! <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Jesus, that's so God. demonic. <laughs> <laughs> but it's appropriate for this time of year, though. I guess. <laughs> Once again, almost 30,000 experience points. Zun Wo, <laughs> uh, who is apparently supposed to be Zun Yu, is your main target here. Not a problem. The only important target here is Zun Yu. So guess what all the rest <laughs> of our power pills are going to? Oh, yeah, yeah. 7,000! Yeah! We are no match for you. Oh there are three more gate battles, and then there's a double battle at the end. We're not gonna do that just yet. It's time for uh, what I'd like to call power leveling. So what's the count for the number of things Opai has said and should regret, but hasn't? <laughs> Too many to goddamn count. What? Infinity what? plus one. 41,000! Wan Jing is at 36,000, Zhao Yun is at 39,000, Ma Chao is at 33,000, Yang Wei is at 39,000, Zhu Yang at 33,000, Wang Zhong at 30,000. However, this is the max level you can get through experience points. If you didn't talk to a certain NPC in the game, there is a way to get to level 51, and I'm gonna be showcasing that right now. You don't have enough experience for the next level yet, but since your cause is just, I will raise your level anyway. We gain a level! 43,000, 38,000, 41,000, 35,000, 41,000, 35,000, and 32,000. Welcome to the true level cap! <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, Ooh, if, you leave, uh, if you leave if you leave this guy and don't talk to him until you get to level 50, you get to the real level cap, level 51. This seems more like an oversight. Probably. But I'll take it. We can teleport back to the last city we were. However, since our next destination is um, Luo Yang, we can actually just teleport back to the first time in the game. Anyways, let's just manually go there. What's the worst that could happen? Getting attacked by chums from the beginning of the game? Absolutely. See, my he's nuts. Also, oh, yes, yeah, so now we've got over a million experience points. Not like it's gonna matter. Nope. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh! Oh one! Oh one soldier died! Oh! Oh! oh isn't that sad? Anyway, last week. Fun fact! 
If you hadn't recruited them, the Anwe would be showing here. A quirk of the fact that we're in the Luoyang area of Dongzhu, the rebel forces have uh, only a hundred soldiers or so. Honestly, this is the only one that you can do that, as far as I know. Okay, we do have a dangerous target here, though. This guy. This Thank guy has him. Jimmy on. Which means, unfortunately, I need to use Simeon. I have a city nearby. Here's a tactic I don't use that often. The tactic Beiji. Because uh, what it does is it increases attack power and it doesn't matter who uses it. I wasn't even breathing at all. How are you alive then? <laughs> Either that or my fan is hitting my mic. That might be it then. God damn it, Guan More, <laughs> More evidence that Opie Man has been replaced by Opie Bot. <laughs> there we go. Battle is over oh, now. No. Oh no, Simeon ran out. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. We're murdering these assholes. Oh no. Oh no. Our bars aren't even going down. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, I think the only person we need to watch out for is another Jimian asshole. Because, of course. Especially since, once again, he was about to try to use Jimian. A freaking jerk butt. And, of course, Simeon ran out. Oh, it's okay. We have a hint just nearby. <sighs> Yang Wei! God. We're supposed to do the thing before! How oh, they get free oh. turns? Not allowed. Okay, Jimian ran out. Good. Kick Good. his ass. Fuck off. <laughs> Murder him. Murder that kill, please. 7,000 damage. There we go. There we go. It's the, it's all about the annoying tactics at this point in the game. Okay, one more attack. There we go. We're done. We're seriously done at this point. Well, no, because we still have two battles after this. The two sons of Sima Yi. First off, we've got Sima Shi, which uh, has the usual bullshit of one Fujimian and Ansha, so... Um, Guess what we have to do? Pretty much in the same boat. Gonna start with Beiji and Simeon. Fortunately, that went first, especially since they tried to use their usual bullshit. And now let's hope that uh, Simeon actually sticks. It did. Good. Let's start chucking these power pills. Even you, you're gonna use a power pill. Serve us, we can pay you well. He tried to kill us. Oh, it's just you be pay you to throw your lives away. And they're gonna do a lot of talking for some reason. Sweet! But this asshole to below 10,000 already. Their physical attacks is not that strong, honestly. They're strong, but you can't stand against my attack. Which missed because Simeon. Speaking of, it's still going. I'll just let me pay you to throw life away. Fuck you, attack. Attempted. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit. Which I probably shouldn't have done because he used Jimian. Ah! Yeah, he has one foo. How could you have withstood our attack? Shang Bao. My destiny is to conquer the whole land. You can't prevent it. Final battle time. <laughs> he still has his usual bullshit, but he doesn't have Ansha. I thought he did. No, instead there's this asshole who does have Ansha and the usual bullshit. Although he does not have one foo. This is why I said you won't be able to recruit this guy and why he has a love soldier because he shows up in the final battle. Why he's here, I don't know. Once again, not a primary target at all. Your second target after defeating Sima Yi. Chang Yu. Oh god. <laughs> Fucking Ansha bullshit. We Fuck don't you. even talk about Zushu. Fuck you and your Jimian bullshit. 
Can we not? This music is actually awesome! God, I think that's my last Simeon, though. Good. What can you see my you with this 250 agility? Well, piss. That's gonna be problematic. Oh, good, he used Jimian. I love it. Fuck you. Oh, you recovered Eugene. Good job. You know, the guy I didn't do any damage to. I'm glad the AI can be stupid still. Even with Sima Yi. Oh, come on, I'm so close. Mm. 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 <laughs> Fucking Jimian! Come on, he only has a pixel of health left. Hmm. A fucking pixel. Just in case, I'm gonna send someone else against him. Kill him. Yeah. Okay. Down he goes. Happy but birthday however, to the However, we still have the freaking Nansha asshole to deal with. Good. We win. We win. <laughs> We win! <laughs> We've already uh, won! We... Was that the Ansha asshole? Yep. Now there's only regular fighters left, and uh, they're chumps. Go all it's up, time baby. to end this! I, I didn't think defeat dead. would come so quickly <laughs> after my victory over South P. But if I am to die, I would have preferred it to be by Liu Bei's own hand. Not one of his henchmen. But Liu Bei only has like 300 soldiers. At least the land is finally united. Sima Yi has died. I was about to say, stop talking, you're dead. You could save here and make it so you're stuck in the ending, essentially. Because uh, as soon as you beat Sima Yi, every encounter in the world disappears. So you could just walk around the place. Zhengbao, Guanjing, Zhao Yun, Ma Chao, Jiang Wei, Shu Giliang, Wang Zhong, my people. Finally, peace rings again. I thank you all for your devoted effort. Through this great trial, I have gained much wisdom. I will rule fairly, but with an iron hand so that no uprising can threaten peace again. For the late 80s and early 90s RPG on the NES, I mean... It's pretty good, I'd say. A game I discovered quite a number of years ago, and I'm glad to have had the chance to actually replay it. Fuck you, Zhao Yun, for giving me my first game over, by the way. <laughs> Thank you very much, everyone, for coming by.